Hey there, honey. This book is just for you. And on this very day, July 8th, 2022, we shall become one. I, Catherine Elise Borg, for just a little bit more, promise to love you from now until forever. Hi, Andrew Lee Bernhardt, promise to love you from now until quadruple forever. Oh my gosh, you so loved me. Yeah, four times longer than you. <laughs> I'm so very thankful for these things about you. Put your work ethic, your ambition, the way you love me, how you care for your family, and your smoking bot. <coughs> the morning air is waiting for us now. I hope you know that I'm so very thankful for these things about you. Call into the space between the clouds. How you are loving and kind-hearted. How you are patient. How you serve me in so many ways. How you love me unconditionally. We will go as far as our feet can take us. Heaven knows the world that we will find. But from the beginning of creation, God made them male and female. Therefore a man shall leave his father and mother and hold fast to his wife, and the two shall become one flesh. So they are no longer two, but one flesh. What therefore God has joined together, let not man separate. Amazing, honey. Take a look. Very pretty, honey. It is my honor to publicly announce that you are husband and wife according to the ordinances of God. Those whom God has joined together, let no one put asunder. You may now kiss your wife. I spent quite a few years of my life praying for my future husband, asking God to bless him, protect him, and bring him to me sooner rather than later. But little did I know that I was praying for you. My hope for you is that every last dream of yours comes true. I hope you continue to be the amazing woman that I fell in love with years ago. You are my best friend, my rock, and my better half. You are my world my life, my love, and my only. I vow to be by your side through it all, through sickness and health, the best days and the most challenging days. I love you so much and can't wait to see what the future will hold for us starting now until forever. You're the one I choose and will continue to choose daily. I will be by your side no matter what stands in our way. I love you.
for those of you who don't know, Andrew's been one of my best friends since we were only eight years old, and I can still remember our first ever sleepover. And the reason why it's so memorable is because Andrew, at the age of eight years old, was snoring like an 85-year-old man. When you walked into the room, I couldn't keep my eyes off of you. Despite our eight-year age gap, Katie and I have always been able to have deep conversations and discussions about our faith and about life in general. <laughs> One of, I'm sorry, this, I knew this would happen. <laughs> One of my best memories with Katie was the day we got baptized, standing in the water together and proclaiming to the world our love for Jesus. I remember respecting her so much in that moment for her boldness. She continues to make me the proudest big sister there ever was. <laughs> The rest of our lives The rest of our lives The rest of our lives I can't put into words how excited I am for the two of you guys as you move into this next stage of life and I can't wait to see the things that God has in store for you. Take my